Hey there, Soul Shines. It's Michelle here, and this is Cheyenne. Cheyenne, my daughter. And we are coming to you with a new series for my channel. What you making? And before we move on, I would like to invite you to hook that subscribe button. <laughs> Knit the like button. <laughs> and leave some yarn in the comments. <laughs> she thinks that the knit part was extra cheesy. <laughs> Alright, so um, this week Cheyenne decided to try something that she hasn't done for a really long time. I think the last time. time was when I was like 12. Yeah, it's been a very long time. She decided to pick up those things that so many of us like called hooks. And she started crocheting. So, what have you been making? I made these. And I made your pair. She has a problem with the texture of yarns. So, we got... Oh, you know what would suck? It would suck if this wasn't working. It says it's working. Okay. <laughs> that made me nervous. Okay, she, so we got her some soft cotton. So she's been working on soft cotton and so she made some fingerless mitts for me and fingerless mitts for herself and these are her finished objects. Yay! I did these ones first. Yeah, she did these ones first. There's definitely differences between them but it's fine. It was hard to measure because they got stretched out differently. And you know, and also as sewing the, it got complicated. And all of us as crocheters know that our gauge will change as we learn and as we improve. And so some of the things that are maybe mine are pretty off much the same about them are getting resolved as you learn more and more and it's all good. You should see. I wish I wish I have the first thing that I ever made. Do those count as the first thing I ever made? I don't think I ever finished anything when I was 12. I don't know. You made the strap for your own bag. Oh, you're right. <laughs> Only I just kept switching stitches based off what my hand did, and so I'm not entirely sure what <laughs> stitches I used, if they're really real stitches. There's real stitches, yeah. <laughs> um, anyway, she, uh, my first, uh, my very first thing I made was a little Barbie afghan. And at one end of it was this wide, and the other end of it was this way. And I did this thing where it kind of went up a, a little, little bit. Cape. And then it, oh no. <laughs> it, it, it almost looked like a Utah. It like, seriously, it had, oh, it no. kind of went together and all of a sudden it had this jog in it. And I was like, what the heck? So you made, And I don't know how I did it. You made a cape for our cat thing. No, I made a baby Afghan, she, my, a Barbie Afghan. My Barbies used it. Oh boy. Yes. But, you know, I've learned since then. How old then, were you? Like eight or something. My grandma taught me how to crochet. My grandma did not. My mom did, and then YouTube. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> All right, so what are you working on? What are your whips? There's, there's this one, which are also the same kind of gloves. Right, you gotta show it, you gotta show it to the camera. I was trying to switch the yarn to the hand, but okay. Okay, so she's making this one. Why did you choose blue? Because that's Amy's favorite color. So she's making these for Amy. I'd say I'm about halfway. Yeah, I'd say you're about halfway. This is really pretty. This yarn is... I love this cotton from Hobby Lobby. Do we have a color name? Denim blue. Shocker. So this is 100% cotton, four weight cotton. Very nice. The, this cotton on my hands I know is the Mainstays Walmart cotton. And then you're also wearing I Love This Cotton, which is this, the brown version of that um, blue stuff. 
Do you you have another work in progress? Did you bring it? Yeah. This seems bad. Should have taken it out before we were ready. Yeah, because now you get to do the crunchy, crunchy thing. I know I irritate people every time I do that. Asthma! <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Don't fall. Thank you. Ta da! <laughs> it's so pretty! What is it? <laughs> Ta da! <laughs> it's gonna. What are they called? It's the like, uh, bands that go over the ears. Or the, was it the hat? I don't know I don't which one you're making. Doing. You sent. You were. You started out with the, the band. If I find the video, I can. You, I can tell you. You were do, making the band, right? I don't know. We talked about several. I things. know she was work. Um, she's like this lady. This lady's so cute, and she's making this thing. And she shows me that her nose. Like hand. that's Crystal. Crystal Bago Day. Easy crochet twisted headband. She's making a twisted headband to match. Yeah, it's the same yarn. I should probably send you the link to that. Yes. But I will do that. Can include it in the description below as well as the link to the video she used for the um, mitts. I'll link in the video or the description below. So, yeah. Maybe one of these times she'll join me in the mystery yarn challenge. Ooh. That'd be fun. That would be fun. I come up with great ideas for that for you. Yeah, I don't and know. And there are some ideas that I come up with that I'm like, she would never do that. Do you have the skills to do them yourself? Yeah. <laughs> I have the skills to do anything I want. She's learned a lot of new stitches recently. Remembered oh. stitches she knew from years ago. That was cool. The only thing I learned so far um, was doing the half double in the same stitch. Double crochet two together in the same stitch. Oh yeah, that's what it was called. I was close. <laughs> that's what I learned. And back looping, or well, single crocheting in the back loop of your chain. Yeah, I actually started having fun with that, and then it was over, and I was like, oh. Because I got a system that made it really easy. Mm-hmm. And, yeah. <laughs> You're funny. What else? What else, are, what else is going on? What do you mean? I don't know. Have you learned anything else? Not yet, but I haven't worked more on this project yet. <laughs> She started that yesterday. Yeah, last night. She started the blue fingerless gloves yesterday. But I can only work on them when my sister's gone, so. Yeah. I should be working on them now. Oh, we're recording a video now. I can work while we record. <laughs> you could, if you wanted. Um, and then you finished these both yesterday, right? Yeah. The... I finished like one glove each before yesterday, and then I finished the other two. She was going to finish these ones, but then we had to go buy more yarn. Yeah, I was so close. Yeah. Anyway, that's what Cheyenne's making. Yep. And next time she'll come in and she should have finished objects to share, and maybe she'll have started on a new project. Because we like starting new projects. Uh, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. I still anyway, need to film that video. No, we do. We have another video to play, plan out and film for you guys. Play is perfect. It is play. <laughs> we have another video to play for you guys. Um, Shannon of Another Yarn will relate. Anyway. She'll love it. <laughs> she'll <laughs> Anyway, that's what we have. Is there any, are, are we done? Is there anything more you want to say? No. That was a question mark. Well, yeah. Okay. Um, do you have anything you're making that is not yarn related? Uh, not yet, but hopefully today I'll order the supplies for what I'm planning to do. We'll let you know when they come. All right. 
with that, remember to let your light shine through your creations. What <laughs> an everyday be. <laughs> and we'll see you guys next time. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Did it stop? It didn't stop. <laughs>